Yo, 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 what is going on, everybody? It's Pavin, and we're finally back with some content. Yes, sir, you got that right. It's been a minute since I've recorded a video. I'm gonna say maybe a week, at least a live com. And uh, today, we had a bunch of new cars that came out for this new standout promo, alongside the three new 50 players that I will be showing you in one second. So I'm obviously not going to go through all of them because it's just way too many. Um, I will be going through the cards that I think are really good and or, you know, I might be using. And obviously the best the best card so far, in my opinion, is this new Josh Allen. Um, and I'm going to be doing a gameplay with them uh, very soon in this same video. As we can see, 82 speed, 93 throw power, 85 short, 84 mid, 83 deep. 83 throw under pressure. I mean, his throwing stats are not the greatest, but he is 6'5". He has 82 speed. And, you know, just wait until we look into his abilities. Another good car that, you know, you guys may want to take a peep at is this Legerious, Legerious Sneed. And I knew this guy was a glitch because I played regs with him and he was picking everything off. 92 speed, 86 man, 86 zone, 87 press. And he is six foot one. And his most underrated stat, in my opinion, I know th hit power doesn't matter that much due to the lack of fumbles this year. But if I could find it, uh, I can't find it. It doesn't show me. Let me just go scroll all the way down. He has 81 pursuit, which is really good for a cornerback, and 78 hit power. If you power him up, they're going to get in the 80s and possibly, you know, like 82, 83, which is really, really good for a cornerback. For all my Raiders fans, there was a new car today for the standout promo. And he is a monster. If you power him up, he's gonna get conductor, hot route master, set feet lead, any combo of those two. Unfortunately, you can't use all three. Two is had to, you know, you gotta deal with only two of them, which is if he could get three, then he'd be the best quarterback in the game, without a doubt. Um, but you know, he's a little slow on the sp speed side. I wish he was uh faster than 78 speed but trust me the raiders team team is coming very soon i probably said that a bunch of times but i could legitimately tell you that i will have a raiders team team series coming out soon due to the sole fact that we're getting a bunch of raider cards my guys and lastly the new best cornerback in the game is this dominique rogers Camardi. um unfortunately i don't have his power up stats so you know base this off his power up and then add probably three to four speed 92 speed 91 excel 91 man 89 zone 8 91 press he could get up to the 95s without a doubt um these cards when you power them up they just they become a whole different player he's six foot two i mean this card is probably the best cornerback in the game without a doubt i don't think he could hit 63 hit power that's whatever 75 pursuit is also whatever but this card if you've been a madden fan for a while a mutt fan you know how good drc is and also, we did get a Brett Favre today. This card actually isn't bad at all. He's a little slower. I would, uh, you know, say he's more of an accurate Josh Allen, just a little bit slower than Josh Allen. He's gonna get a bunch of nice chems. Um, you know, if you're a Packers theme team guy, there is a Rod out there. But if you want to just use Brett Favre, I know he was really good at Madden 17. I think this is the first year he's back in the game. Go ahead and get the original Gunslinger on your team. With all that being said, I'm going to upgrade my team a little bit and we will get into the gameplay itself. I'm going to be rocking out with Josh Allen and, you know, we'll see who else I get. For now, I'm going to, you know, quick sell these trophies, get my coins up, and we'll be in the video. We're back, boys. We just bought a couple of these cards now. I'm going to be upgrading them and showing you what abilities they get. So here is Josh Allen's stats without any sprinter, go deep, or anything. Uh, 83 speed, 94 throw power. I mean, he has like 80 change of direction, 80 juke move. I want to see what his trucking is, 65. That's not the best, but he does truck in real life. And this this might be the best quarterback out right now. I'm going to get him badged up, and we'll be getting to our next players. So his abilities, he gets a, a lot of abilities. And he gets Fearless, Roaming Deadeye, Gunslinger, Anchored Extender. Whatever you could think of, he has it. Um, and, you know, I would have been super, super happy if he could get uh fearless or gunslinger in the second slot unfortunately he does not um but you know maybe in the future i'm using past uh, set feet elite set feet lead i don't know why i say elite in the second slot maybe fearless in the next for now we're gonna just rock out with gunslinger and see how gunslinger is no other quarterback has it until today i'm sure brett Favre has it as well and honestly that's what we're gonna just keep it at because he is only one ap 
with that gunslinger gunslinger might be cracked out this year boys and why not do omaha i guess this is my first time using omaha this year hopefully we're able to get it in the gameplay the next card is this dk metcalf we just scooped him up let me power him up real quick guys and the good thing about these cards is they don't take that much training in my opinion as you can see right here we're just getting our power passes and this isn't a lot of training at all 160 220 450 it's right here we're gonna fully power him up 93 speed he's gonna get up to 95 with double sprinter 76 trucking kind of glitchy man i can't even lie uh his route running is a little low but trust me with all these you know route running thresholds we'll get him up there as right here 89 beat press 87 deep route running 87 short 84 mid which is not the best but you know definitely can get him chemmed up and one thing to know is he has 86 break tackle so i mean dk is going to be out here glitching for us if you guys want to see his abilities i don't think i'm going to chem him up this game he gets outside apprentice which is nice route tech wow but it is a lot for him matchup nightmare interesting slot of Maddox for 4 AP, wow. Mid and elite, mid out elite, and that's pretty much it, guys. But this DK is not really one that's gonna be, you know, for his routes and or, you know, chems, as we did get that new Darren Waller. Raider Nation, shout out to Darren Waller. We're gonna put him in the lineup right now. But like I was saying, uh, you use DK to beat the press, and everyone runs man press this year, so he's gonna be really, really good. It's right here, Darren Waller inserted into the lineup. I'm not gonna lie, our team is looking nice, but I just spent 1.8 mil, 1.5 mil on three players. That's honestly a lot. We're gonna put that tight end apprentice on Darren Waller and make sure he's our number one tight end. And if you're interested about his stats, I do not have double sprinter activated right now, but he will get to 90 speed and I will have a Raiders team team. So he'll get up to 92 speed for us. As right now, here's our team. We're missing a lot of players. Uh, I'm in the like kind of recreate mode. We're just going to get into the gameplay itself. And by the next time, our team will be set and ready. <laughs> it's pretty glitchy to see that Waller is my best receiver at a 91 overall, even though he is a tight end. So if you guys want to run some two, one, some two tight end sets and audible down, Waller is your guy. Waller and Jimmy Graham probably until we get a new Kittle. Here's the defense, guys. Like I said, it's not complete at all. And don't peep these 79 overalls right here. They're going to be Byron Jones and Denzel Ward right there. I was doing Pats and Niners, and then Raiders just seemed too glitchy not to use. So we're definitely going to go with Raiders as we see Denzel Ward just chilling right there. So we finally chemmed up everyone, uh, got our full abilities out there. Let's just get right in the gameplay. I'm super eager to use this Josh Allen, boys. We are going to be playing on this all Madden Mutt mode. We are 9-0 currently. And, you know, we're in our playoffs. If we get a quit out, you know, fast, we will play our Super Bowl in here. Let's just see how this gameplay goes. This is all Madden, boys. Gotta love it. Powerhouse, 1281. Doesn't have a great team. He does have Brady, so he might have a Pat Steam team. That Brady, shout out to Brady, man. He's been playing kind of well. Yesterday, he did kind of shit the sheets versus the Bears. And all I gotta say is four. If you know, you know. And if Josh Allen somehow is trash, you know I'm going to use my guy, DC4, Derek Carr. I have his jersey. But that's for another video. We'll see how it looks like right now. We're going to put DK in the slot. Of course, he doesn't want to go in the slot. I think we're going to put Barry out wide. And I guess Tyree Kill on the bunch side receiver. We definitely need some new receivers, guys. Um, I'm waiting for Moss low-key, but we'll see when it comes out, boys. It's right here, little double post action. And Gunslinger, man, oh my god, I've never been in more love than I am right now. My opponent is taking a while to call his play, but Gunslinger, man, uh, Gunslinger just looked phenomenal right there. And of course, our opponent calls a timeout. Right here, decent little route combo, boys. Just kind of trying to get Waller open right here, see what we got going on. And boom, Waller's so open, and he might be out of there. Patrick Chung can't catch him. Somehow Malcolm Jenkins almost caught me, but he's not able to. Waller's first touchdown. That was a dime by Josh Allen. I mean, that was just bad defense by my opponent. Look at this release. So that gunslinger goes crazy. Right here, my opponent, opponent is going to 
take the ball out with Edelman. Not the wisest choice, but hey. And he's going straight to single back wing tight. Let me set up my defense real quick. And guys, it's always refreshing when there's some new cards, you know. Uh, right now, I'm, I'm just looking at all these cards and I'm just super, super hyped. So right here, we're going to have to put Taylor Mays at the user. That's what we're able to do right here, setting up the run D. He is in a run heavy set. We shall see what he does. He does end up passing. And he almost burnt me, so I'm going to have to watch out for that. I'm definitely backing up Rod Woodson after seeing that. Honestly, I'm just about to man up Dion. Usually, when in doubt, man Dion up. As right here, he does run the ball with Sony Michelle for five yards. Nice little run play. And now he's in gun empty Saint. So five wide, bazooka form. See what we got going on right here. I'm gonna just, we, we can't spy Brady. We're gonna zone Brady up, make him make a read. And that's what he does, except it's to my team. And you gotta love it. The, the drop picks are still in the game. Something that needs to be fixed ASAP. I would get in uh, uh, 146 boys, but it's just like, it's gonna take a whole lot of time to set up my, uh, my audibles, my substitution. So we're gonna play the same defense again. I would blitz him, but man, it's just hard to blitz five wide. Um, he has Brady. Brady has a decent release. He's right here. He has nothing wide open. And Shaq Barrett, a.k.a. Crack Barrett, comes in free for that shed. My opponent should be getting out of here soon, guys. Um, but for now, let's just let's just see what my guy... Let's, see, let's just see what my guy, Josh Allen, could do. A lot of people said he's an MVP frontrunner right now which I don't blame him. Him and Russ have been probably the best quarterbacks this year. It's right here. We're going to try to hit this rollout corner dot. Oh my God. What a dot. I'd never seen that animation before from Darren Waller. I've never seen a dot like that from Josh Allen. It's a perfect combo right there. And look at Waller just silencing the crowd. Look at this dot, man. He gets up there. Absolutely dunking on Arenas Williams. I think that's how you say his name. Unfortunately, my opponent just paused to not quit out. So we might be here for a while, guys. Once more, my opponent is in the wing tight. And he has Cam Newton in the game now, which is pretty funny. He saw Brady wasn't working out for him. And he decided to put Cam in as Taylor Mays is all over that for a loss of five yards. Taylor Mays goes crazy. Once more, he is in a super, I don't even know what this formation is, honestly, guys. Some type of wing tight once more. And we're going to fake the user rush, get back with the user, and nice little dunk down by him. I honestly didn't see that guy, honestly. And guys, if this guy doesn't get out of this game after this play, I'm probably just going to end up flooding him. And, you know, I'm either going to... Cut the video down or i'm just gonna fast forward to the next play as right here he actually does throw a dot but adrian wilson is all over that and cover three cloud kind of gets glitched like that this year i'm not too sure why but my safety just went all the way in the box and he almost got beat by julian edelman that's something you don't want to see once more this time we're gonna man some guys up and this should be good defense guys i'm gonna put Justin Smith in a vert hook just to be there, man, just so he can't throw something right in between the zones. And right here, he's going to try to go deep, but Dion says, no, 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 not on me. And he might get up and might get out of there. Oh, man, this might be six. Spin back inside. Oh, yeah, this is six. We're out of there. Dion. Bruh. Dion Sanders just got caught by a lineman. That's something you never want to see, man. That spin was crispy. I thought I was out of there. Next thing you know, Deion Sanders getting caught by a lineman. Once I score right here, man, we're going to fast forward and just end this gameplay. Right here, running flood with a table route. Really looking for R1 to be open. And my guy isn't even playing anymore. And there it is. DK Metcalf's first reception. Boys, my opponent is not going to quit out probably. I'll catch you guys in a little bit.